Let's visit about defining and preventing authentic and inauthentic paraphrasing. To paraphrase is to summarize in your own language the ideas found in a source. It cannot be a near copy or be a copy of the word order of the original writer's language. To copy the language, word order, or structure of the source of the author's writings is a definition of inauthentic paraphrase. And if you claim to, to yourself or to others that the notes represent your own language, you are inauthentically paraphrasing. Pause the video. Now pause the video so you can read the sample of the paraphrase of the original. Are you detecting inauthentic paraphrasing? You would be correct. The red highlighted language of the paraphrase is identical to the original. The purple highlighted language are synonyms or what we call word patching. If you look closely, even the order of the ideas in the paraphrase are identical to the original. So how to paraphrase authentically? Well, first of all, allow yourself time to reflect upon what you've read and what it means before you even take notes or try to summarize. Allow yourself time to study so that you avoid the appeal of copying text from sources. This is inauthentic paraphrasing. After reading and reflecting, then make your notes. And when you're making your notes, Make notes on just the major points of the thesis, the paragraph topic sentences, the use of evidence, rather than try to repeat everything that you're reading. If you are struggling to paraphrase and need to make notes, then always write the passage verbatim encased in quotation marks. This will signal to yourself that you have not paraphrased. Always make note of page numbers, the author and the title of the publication, whether you're paraphrasing or quoting directly. How to avoid inauthentic paraphrasing? Well, first of all, don't allow yourself to simply replace a few major words with synonyms. That is plagiarism. Study the source, set it aside, and then take notes. One of the potential causes for inauthentic paraphrasing is actually a comprehension problem. So, are you having difficulty focusing? Are you struggling with the vocabulary? Are you paying attention to the structure of the argument? And, of course, there is the chance that the source is poorly or ineffectively written. Whether intentional or not, inauthentic paraphrasing is a serious violation of academic integrity.